many people spend up to 90% of their time indoors. And, with millions suffering from year-round allergies, what they are exposed to in the air in their homes, schools, and work environments is important. Allergies can not only affect a person's quality of life, each year they cost society billions of dollars in medical care and lost productivity. Not to mention, allergies are responsible for countless missed school days. Some of the more common indoor allergens include mold, pollen, dust mites, cockroaches, latex, rodents, and pet dander, saliva, and urine. People can also experience allergy symptoms from exposure to airborne particulates, volatile organic compounds, smoke, and numerous other substances. Even for those without allergies, exposure to some of these substances can cause respiratory irritation or act as an asthma trigger for some asthmatics. Regarding the impact of biological pollutants on indoor air quality, the U.S. Environmental Protection Agency states that allergic reactions occur only after repeated exposure to a specific biological allergen. However, that reaction may occur immediately upon re-exposure or after multiple exposures over time. As a result, people who have noticed only mild allergic reactions or no reactions at all may suddenly find themselves very sensitive to particular allergens. Fortunately, there are ways to test the indoor environment for the presence of allergens. If found at elevated concentrations, steps can then be taken to mitigate or eliminate exposure. These may include identifying and eliminating sources of indoor mold growth, improving ventilation and air filtration, changes to cleaning protocols, such as switching to the use of a vacuum with HEPA filtration, or one of many other steps that exist that could benefit those suffering from allergies. These are just a few of the many things to know about common indoor allergens. To learn more about this or other indoor air quality, industrial hygiene, environmental health or safety issues, please visit the website shown on the screen. IAQ-TV, the place to be.